if I don't have strength for myself, how can I expect other people to have strength for me? So in 20, uh, 2013, uh, I was on RuPaul's Drag Race and I decided to disclose my HIV status. Telling my story for me was necessary, mostly, honestly, because there wasn't a lot of representation for black men on television, you know, talking about something that is so stigmatized and so running so rampant within our own community. There was no black man, black men, other than Magic Johnson, who had came out publicly about their status. My journey became bigger than me. I started off doing this, just doing drag, and the drag found something else that was more important. I think the most important thing for anybody who's dealing with HIV or who may have been newly diagnosed is once you have gone through that hurdle of beating yourself up or questioning yourself or whatever the case may be, get on your treatment and move on with your day-to-day -day life. Life doesn't really stop when you live with HIV.